Okay, so it's Saturday night. Wife and kids are gone. I'm at home watching some football. In the past, my options would be order pizza if I didn't want to leave the house. But now, you've got third-party delivery. And as we speak, my Uber Eats driver just showed up. And so, if you're a pizza restaurant, ask yourself this. Your customers years ago had one option, pizza. Now, as I'm about to do here, I'm gonna go pick up my wings. I'll be back. Are you doing a prank or something? No. Oh, I was scared. Talk to somebody. Thank Thanks. you. No pranks, just some wings. Okay, yeah, the driver didn't know why I was videotaping. So, I'll show you that wasn't set up. But I've got Quaker steak and lube, I've got some wings. And I think a lot of pizza restaurants are feeling the crunch right now because of third-party delivery because Matt Plapp and my family a couple years ago when we were at home ordering food our option was to order pizza and now our options are a plethora I could have wings I could have burgers I could have euros I could have a salad I don't order salads very much but I could have a lot of different things so ask yourself if you're a pizza restaurant that depends on delivery are you doing anything unique to stand out to get that market share back? And if you're not a pizza restaurant, if you're a Quaker Steak and Lube type restaurant, if you're a fast casual, if you're a, a brand that maybe you're a pizza restaurant like Rapid Fired Pizza on Mall Road in Florence, Kentucky, up street from my house, are you using third party to get people that you might not have had before? So either way, whether you used it before or you didn't, there's an opportunity. But the biggest opportunity is right now is being missed by traditional pizza places that aren't doing what they used to do, which was deliver pizza on Saturday nights because people like me have changed it up. I had wings tonight. Last week I ordered burgers from a place. And yes, we still order pizza, but now I have so many more choices. So ask yourself, Mr. Pizza Delivery Company, what are you doing to change things up? What are you doing to get your customers back? I don't have all the answers for you, but I know one of them. It's you better build a database. You better find out who loves you and you better find out how to get them to stop ordering wings from somebody else order wings from you on that Saturday night when they're home alone. See you later. Go and enjoy some food.